What is up, App Nation? It is Steve P. Young, founder of AppMasters.com, the app marketing agency that's really going to help you growth hack your download. And today, I want to show you our ASO process that is guaranteed to grow downloads. We've had some tremendous success helping clients 2x, 3x, and even 11x download for one of our favorite clients. We went from 80 daily downloads to over three to 400 daily downloads. It's an insane growth. So we're not just talking five to 10. We're talking insanely, insanely huge growth. Today, I want to talk about the most important factors that have helped us really grow downloads for our number one. And the most important one is keyword research. It's really finding the best keywords for your app. So in terms of relevance, traffic scores, and difficulty, those are the top three factors that I look at when deciding which keyword to use. All right, here's one of my favorite ASO tools out there. It is called app radar and they are phenomenal and full disclosure. They are sponsoring our podcast, but it's a tool that I've always admired and I've always paid attention to. And here's what I'm doing within app radar. What we have here are, this is my app and these are the keywords that I'm targeting. And so what you want to do with keyword research is find the keywords that are the most popular and obviously that have the least difficulty. Okay. I'm ranking pretty well for rain sounds at number eight. It's a very popular keyword and it's a pretty difficult keyword to rank for, but I've got different hacks to help us to help me rank well for these particular keywords, right? And so that's what you're looking for. The higher the popularity, the better it is. Now, Google and Apple, they don't tell you this popularity score doesn't tell you how many searches there are for a particular keyword, nor does it tell you how many downloads you're going to get for that particular keyword. But just know the higher, the better and the difficulty, the lower, the better. Now, another factor I, that I've been using in terms of whether I should target a keyword or, or not, number one, if it's highly relevant, I want that keyword. But if there's a low number of apps that show up, so under 100, no matter what the difficulty score says, I may go after that keyword because I know that even if it says an ASO tool says, hey, this is a very difficult keyword, well, I know that because there aren't that many apps showing up that I could potentially rank well for that particular. So keyword research is so, so important. And I've got a lot of videos that show you how to do keyword research that I will link up into the description and at the end of this video as well. Number two is screenshots. So you really want to optimize your on page app store listing. That's really going to help you drive downloads. Here's a past client of ours that we grew downloads tremendously. So we double their downloads just with the keyword research. And then secondly, we double their downloads 91% to be exact by optimizing their screenshots. And here's all we did. Look, this is, these are beautiful, right? What we really lead with is what the app does. So the first screenshot should be your unique selling point. What makes your app unique or what your app does, right? Sort of reiterate some of the keywords that you're going after. So for this app, it is electronic signatures and we're making it so stinking simple. We're showing you a screen that makes it so stinking simple that this is a very simple app. And secondly, and here's why we were able to increase downloads by 91% is because we're adding social proof. So if you've been featured by Apple or you've got some major brands using your app, we'll highlight them. And that's what we did with this app. And the rest of the screenshots are more feature and benefit based, but these are very critical. And especially on iOS, the first three screenshots are going to be crucial because they are the three that users see within the app store search. You want to make sure you have your unique selling point, some social proof, something that makes you different right in those first three. Don't save it for the end. Have it right in the very beginning. So those two keyword research and screenshots are very important, whether you're on iOS or Google play, it doesn't really matter. But when it comes to iOS, well, there's a secret hack that I still get people not knowing. I'm on calls all the time. I'm like, do you know about this hack? They're like, no, I'm like, man, you haven't watched that many of my YouTube videos. Cause it's a very good hack. So I want to highlight this once again, it is called the Spanish Mexico hack. It's a hack that allows you to double the number of keywords that you can target within your ASO. ASO. 
Let's get to it. Here is my Apple iTunes store, and this is iOS specific, and I'll get into the Google Play specific stuff, but here's what we're gonna do. With this hack, what you can do is the US App Store indexes the Spanish Mexico localization. So here's where you can find out, if you're not in the US, what other localizations that you can target. So I'm gonna click this, question mark, and then these. This is Africa, Middle East, and India. I'm gonna go to the US and Canada. So here, Apple even tells you, hey, the US App Store, the United States, here are the languages that it looks at. It looks at. With Canada, it has English and French Canadian, okay? So here's what you're gonna do. If I'm targeting the US App Store, I'm gonna have my keywords here. I'm gonna click this button, go down to Spanish Mexico, and then add different keywords in the app title and the subtitle. And then if I'm in the Canadian App Store, same thing. I'll have Canadian English, different keywords here, and subtitle, and then French Canadian. If I were just targeting the English side of things, I'll have English keywords in here. And that way I'm able to double up the amount of keywords I'm targeting. Same things goes for your keyword field that you're gonna find right here. Right here. You can go after those specific keywords and then here you go under Spanish Mexico. So I'm going to go right here, my 2.0. But in the Spanish Mexico, I'm going to add a bunch of different tricks, different keywords here. So definitely use different English keywords in your title, subtitle, and your keyword fields. That allows you to double the amount of keywords that you're going after. All right, on the Google Play side of things, so this is 3B, first one, 3A. On the Google Play side of things, what you wanna focus on is when you first initially launch your app, drive a little bit of paid traffic. Just like SEO and on the web, Google's not gonna rank a brand new site number one for valuable keywords. They wanna see that you're legit, that you update your content or update your app before they give you some prominent ranking. So you wanna drive a little bit of paid traffic, anywhere that gets you at least a thousand. They could be anywhere in the world, but you want to drive a little bit of paid traffic. Secondly, things that people aren't working on are going to be your package name. That's very important. Your developer name, very important and building backlinks. So besides optimizing your title, your short description and your long description, optimizing the package name, your developer name, and also building backlinks are very important to Google play. So drive a little bit of paid traffic and optimize those three things I just said. And lastly, we've got some secret hacks that we use to really grow downloads for our clients. And we're so stinking confident that we're gonna grow your downloads that we've got a new offer for you guys that with our ASO packages, if we don't grow your downloads, you're gonna get your money back guaranteed. That's how confident we are with our process. So if you wanna work with us, check it out. It is appmasters.com. We'll look at your organic downloads before the optimization and then after the optimization and if those downloads don't increase we don't want your money we'll do the work for free you get to learn all our secrets everything that's involved in how we do our aso process and if we don't grow your downloads heck here's your money back i'm sorry but i'm so confident that we are that i'm willing to put some money on the line for it all right, guys, if you want to work with us, check out appmasters.com. And if you've been enjoying this content, make sure you hit that like, make sure you hit that subscribe. My son's friends think I'm famous. So let's, let's get those subscribers out a little bit more so I feel a little bit more famous, all right? All right, until next time, I'll see you on the next video. Peace.